Hello there everyone, my name is John Dyer and I work for Ren Music and today I'm here to teach you a really fantastic song called the Exmoor Ram. So I'm really looking forward to teaching you all that. So before we start, it's always good to make sure we're ready. So make sure our body's ready, make sure our breath's ready and our voice is ready because singing is like doing, if, if you don't do PE and don't do warm up, you can hurt yourself. So when we sing, it's good to get ourselves ready for it as well because we don't want to hurt ourselves. So if you want to make sure you can find yourself a bit of room so you can move around and just make sure you're nice and comfortable. So we're just going to give our shoulders a nice quick roll first. If you can, change direction as well. Very good. And maybe both up and one can go either way. Excellent. And this could get all the shake off on me. And what's it sound like if you shake your voice? Good. And then just give me some bouncing on your toes and go uh, 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 like a grumpy teenager. You go, uh, 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 uh. please, can I hear that? Do it with me. And uh, 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 uh. <laughs> lovely. And then give me some shaky hands. Shake, 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 shake it behind, shake it to the side. Excellent. Will they fall off if you shake them really fast? Go on, try it. Try and shake them really fast. Will your hands fall off? Hopefully not. <laughs> Good, and excellent. And then finally, just make yourself as wide as you can. And then make yourself as small as you can. And wide, and then small. And wide as you can, and as small as you can. And wide, and then wide, and then small. And then wide. Excellent, brilliant. So we've got our bodies nice and warmed up there. Excellent, if you need to do any of that again, please do. Great, and then we're going to move on to a bit of breath. So we could, when we were singing, obviously we need to breathe. So we're going to do this with our, our, our candles. It's a great way to start. I think you might have done a pool a couple of weeks ago. We're going to get one candle and pretend it's your first birthday. We're going to blow it out and go, Phew. like that for me. Here you go. <laughs> okay, now we're five. We've learned now how to blow out candles. We're going to blow out one individually. Five candles. Ready, after ready, go. One, two, ready, go. And again, please. One more time, go. Excellent. Now we're going to move on to a huge, huge cake, whatever flavour you want it to be. And it's going to have lots and lots of candles on it. Maybe like 100 candles, okay? And we're going to take a massive breath in. And we're going to try to blow out all the candles in one big breath. Go. Excellent, well done. We're going to breathe in again and blow them all out. You're brilliant, well done. So we've warmed up our body, we've warmed up our breath. And the final thing, we're going to quickly warm up our voices. So can you imagine you've got some bubbly pasta in the pan? Well, the pasta's not bubbly, the water's bubbly. And we're boiling up the pasta. And it sounds like this. And then, I don't know if you ever cook pasta before, but whenever I cook it, the bubbles get higher and higher up the pan and they spill out over the top and make a big mess on the cooker. So, see, so we try to do that with our voices. We're going to go up the pan, we're going to start low. And we get to the top, we can go, and it's going to fall out all over the top of the pan. Should we try that together? Here we go, from the bottom. <laughs> Excellent, and you want to stick your tongue out as far as you can go. Do it, doesn't matter. Okay, let's try it one more time. Bubbly pasta. <laughs> Excellent, <laughs> great, well done. And our final thing to warm up our voice is, we're just going to imagine we've got a nice friendly bumblebee on the end of our fingers. Bzzz, and it makes that noise. Bzzz, 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 bzzz. And this bumblebee is on a roller coaster, and it's going to go all the way around this roller coaster. And when it goes up high, bzzz, it's going to sound high, and when it goes down low, bzzz, it's going to sound lower. So it's going to have a little experiment with this bumblebee on this roller coaster. In your own time, if you want to do it with me, here we go. And and it flies off and enjoys the rest of the day. Excellent folks, I hope you're feeling warmed up. Now what we're going to do is look at this brand, well, it's not a brand new song, really exciting song called X More Ram. I'm just going to pick up my guitar. <coughs> so this is a traditional folk song 
from Devon. Um, and Paul Wilson, who you would have met in the videos at the beginning, he actually went up to around that area and listened to a guy called Nobby Clark singing this song and he wrote it down and he shared it with us all. And it's called the Exmoor Ram. <clears throat> now, do you have a listen to the first couple of... I'm going to sing verse one, the chorus, and verse two, and then the chorus, and see if you think it's true. My guitar slightly actually. Okay, have a listen. <clears throat> when I went out to Exmoor, it was a market day. I saw the finest ram, sir, that ever was fed on hay. Now, if you don't believe me, I tell a lie Just go out to think her easy as well as I Now this ram it had two horns That went up to the moon Two men went up in January And never came down till June Now if you don't believe me Think I tell a lie Just go out to think her easy as well as I Now do you think that's true? Maybe. And it could be a massive ram up on Exmoor, isn't it? I'm just going to quickly tune up my guitar, folks. It suddenly got very hot in here. Now let's put my guitar all out of tune. There we are. So. What we're going to do, I'm going to sing you a first bit, and I'm going to sing it to you, me, to you, and then you sing it back to me. So this is first one. It sounds like this. When I went out to Exmoor. Okay? Do you want to try singing that with me? This is what it sounds like on the guitar first, with me singing it. My voice is a bit lower, so you might want to listen to the guitar. It sounds like this. When I went out to Exmoor. Give that a go. And... When I went out to Exmoor. Excellent! The next bit sounds like this. It was a market day. It was a market day. We're going to put those two lines together from me. Have a listen. When I went out to Exmoor, it was a market day. Go! When I went out to Exmoor, it was a market day. Brilliant. Next bit goes this. I saw, I saw the finest ram, sir. Okay, how did that go? Just going down the scale, down the ladder. I saw the finest ram, sir. I'm going to count you in, I'm going to count you in there. Three, four. I saw the finest ram, sir. Excellent. Not the last bit for me. That that ever was fed on hay. That ever was fed on hay. Try singing it. Three, four. That ever was fed on hay. So try to put those two lines together. Have listen to me and sing it back to me. I saw the finest round, so that ever was fed on hay. Go. I saw the finest ram, sir, that ever was fed on hay. You wonderful people, how are you getting on? That's the whole of the verse. That's like the first bit learned, the tune already. You're doing really well. Should we try singing that all the way through? I'm going to sing it once, and then you sing it back to me. Have a listen. <clears throat> when I went out to Exmoor, it was a market day. I saw the finest ram, sir, that ever was fed on hay. Give it a go. One, two, three, four. When I went out to Exmoor, it was a market day. I saw the finest ram, sir, that ever was fed on hay. Brilliant. That's the verse tune. Now, the chorus sound tune is very similar. It starts off very the same. Have a listen to me. Now if you don't believe me, think I tell a lie. Should we just try that? It's exactly the same tune. Now if you don't believe me, you think I tell a lie. Give that a go. One, two, three, four. Now if you don't believe me, you think I tell a lie. Lovely. Last bit. Now slightly changes here. Have a listen. 
Just go out to Pinkery and see as well as I. To try saying that, just go out. Just three, four. Just go out to Pinkery and see as well as I. Now, Pinkery is a very magical place on Exmoor. So that's where Pinkery is. It's a fantastic word, isn't it? Pinkery. Should we just try that last line again? So stop there for me. Let's do it together. Three. Four. Just go out to Pinkery and see as well as I. Excellent, well done. Let's do the whole of the chorus. I'll sing it to once and then you sing it back to me. Have a listen. Now if you don't believe me, you think I tell a lie. Just go out to Pinkery and see as well as I. Try it with me. Three, four. Now, now, oops, try it again. Three, four. Now, if you don't believe me, you think I tell a lie. Just go out to Pinkery and see as well as I. Excellent. Well done, folks. Really well done. Okay, you've learnt it. You've learnt the whole first verse and chorus. Shall we try putting them together all the way through? Try it with me. When I went out to Exmoor. One, two, three. Four. When I went out to Exmoor, it was a market day. I saw the finest round, so that ever was fed on hay. Now, if you don't believe me, you think I tell a lie. Just go out to Pinkery and see as well as I. How did you get on? Well done, I'm sure you did really well. I wish you could hear you. Now, you'll see below this video, there's the lyrics, so you can download the lyrics. So, that's the first verse and chorus. The second verse sounds like this. I'm going to play some chords now. Now this ram, it had two horns that went up to the moon. Two men went up in January and never came down till June. Do you think that's true? Should we just try singing it? And this is verse two, and we'll sing the chorus afterwards. Give it a go. Now this ram, it had two horns. One, two, three. Now this ram, it had two horns that went up to the moon. Two men went up in January and never came down till June. Now if you don't believe me, you think I tell a lie. Just go out to Pinkery and see as well as I. Fantastic. Now verse three. It sounds like this. Now this ram it had four feet, four feet you understand, and every time it put them down, it covered four acres of land. Now an acre is a big large part of land. So you try singing verse three all the way through. Now this ram it had four feet. One, two, three. Now this ram it had four feet, four feet you understand. For every time it put them down, it covered four acres of land. Now, if you don't believe me, you think I tell a lie. Just go out to Pinkery and see as well as I. How are you getting on? It's got a lot of words to fit in that one, isn't there? It's covered four acres of land. So I hope you got on okay with that. Now, our final verse, verse four, it's, the words are, Now this ram it had two eyes. They were so large and round. All the girls in Barnstable kicked them round the town. Wow, can you imagine the size of these eyes? So you know where Barnstable is? Up in North Devon. Shall we try singing that then? Now this ram it had two eyes. Oh, one, two, three. Now this ram it had two eyes. They were so large and round. All the girls in Barnstable kicked them round the town. Now if you don't believe me, you think I tell a lie. Just go out to Pinkery and see as well as I. Excellent, folks. I hope you got on okay with that. That's a lot to learn, a lot of lyrics there. So really well done. Now, what I would, would love you to do, in the activity sheet below, there's a option for you to write your own verse about what you think this lamb might look like and what big features it might have. So you might want to write about its ears or its toes or its nose or um, its wool or anything like that, its legs, 
have a think about what you could write and give it a go below. And then if you can also draw a picture, that would be amazing. It would be great to see what you think this ram might look like, this giant ram. So shall we try singing it all the way through now? We're going to sing verse one and chorus, verse two chorus, verse three chorus, verse four chorus, and then I'm going to play just a chord for you to sing your own verse on, if you like, the one that you wrote up. And then we'll sing two choruses at the end to finish. You've done really well today, folks. Just so you know, between each ver between at the end of each chorus, you'll hear this bit of music. So you'll hear that every time at the end of each chorus. So you know to wait, listen to that, and then come in with the next verse. Shall we try singing it then, all the way through? I'm going to give you a little guitar intro, it sounds like this. One, two, three. When I went out to Exmoor, it was a market day. I saw the finest ram, sir, that ever was fed on hay. Now, if you don't believe me, you think I'd ever lie. Just go out to Pinkery and see as well as I. Verse two. Now this ram, it had two horns, to went up to the moon. Two men went up in January and never came down till June. Now, if you don't believe me, you think I'd tell a lie. Just go out to Pinkery and see as well as I. Verse 3. Now this ram, it had four feet. Four feet, you understand. For every time it put them down, it covered four acres of land. Now, if you don't believe me, you think I tell a lie. Just go out to Pinkery and see as well as I. Last verse, verse four. Now this ram, it had two eyes. They were so large and round. All the girls and bunts the ball, kick them round the town. Now, if you don't believe me, you think I tell a lie. Just go out to Pinkery and see as well as I. Here we go, this is your own verse. Just go out to Pinkery and see us sing on the chorus. Now, if you don't believe me, you think I tell a lie. Just go out to Pinkery and see as well as I. Hey, well done, folks. What a fantastic song. Um, I hope you enjoyed learning that and uh, enjoy writing your own verses for it. Thank you very much.